there are quite obviously um, huge variations from uh, in different parts of the world in terms of uh, the amount of resources available, the amount of money, the amount of bandwidth, uh, general knowledge of uh, internet and the levels of technology and so forth. So it's impossible to uh, create a 100% level playing field no matter how you go at it. Uh, another um, major factor that is quite obvious is uh, that language differences, uh, or the multiplicity of languages, I should say, is uh, another uh, fact that makes it harder for people to work together uh, arbitrarily around the world. Um, we start with making all the documents uh, available free of charge. Uh, we start by making access to any of the forums uh, open to everybody. There's no membership issues, there's no cost issues. Uh, those two things um, are dramatically different from the older types of organizations that uh, are rooted in government uh, structures to begin with. Um, those traditions come out of the, you know, the beginnings of the internet and uh, the things that led to the IETF and the documents and the processes that are associated with that. So that's pretty good. It's not good enough, but it's pretty good. Uh, and then we work hard to improve our, uh, beyond that. And um, always always looking for new ideas on how to, how to make that even better. Uh, gradually getting to the point of putting documents in multiple languages. It's an expensive, tedious process. You uh, can hardly wait till the time when all of that is done automatically by uh, smart processes or Google, each one or the other. Um, and, uh, uh, that will you know, make things yet better. Uh, and so if you have ideas, let's, let's hear about it.